All right, and we're recording. Hey gang, Andy here, coming at you, Pook, with a late night vlog. And my hands kind, of, my right arm's gotten kind of tired, so I'm using my left hand for this vlog. So this is a first for me. I just want to apologize up front for, well, that, <laughs> as well as uh, for the lack of energy in this vlog. I'm coming down with like a fever or something, so. I'm not exactly at 100% for this video, and that's one of the reasons why I haven't been making new videos lately. It's just been re-uploads and stuff. So again, apologies for the lack of energy in this video and for the lack of new videos as well. But the reason that I'm doing this video is because of a comment that I got on one of my, you know, rare new videos that recently came out time it's recording and they were basically asking me something to the effect of why do you still keep doing YouTube after all these years and you only have like so many subscribers I think he said like 200 or something like that and for the record at the time it's recording I have 285 lovely subscribers but I get the general gist that he I'm assuming it's a he is making and that is you know why do I still do YouTube you know why do I put all this effort into something that only gives me a very minimal amount in return. And the simple answer to that is because I love it. I love doing YouTube. I love interacting with everybody in the comments. I love, inter I love watching videos of people. I love making video responses to people and hearing what they have to say and stuff like that. And it has, you know, brought me closer to various people from all around the world and I've made a lot of really good friends off of YouTube you know people who I've met in real life people who I've talked to through like a Google Hangout or I've talked to on Skype stuff like that people who if I were still living in you know old Salina Ohio I would not have met otherwise and so I owe a lot to YouTube for that and it's the reason that I do what I do because I love connecting with people and I love putting myself out there so that way I can connect with other people as well. And I realize that the stuff that I put out there isn't everybody's cup of tea. I realize that not everybody likes my videos or certain types of videos that I do. Or they may think that, oh, you don't use enough B-roll or oh, your voice is annoying or oh, there's too much shaky cam and you know, why don't you cut your hair or something, you know. There's always something with YouTube videos. Regardless, I still love doing what I do. But uh, as Dolph Ziggler would say, sometimes the things you love don't always love you back. And from a subscriber count and from a view, view count, um, my channel is a quote unquote failure. And you know, it hasn't really had the success that it should have considering how long I've been doing it, how many videos I've put up, stuff like that. From that perspective, I do agree, but I love doing YouTube and I love connecting with people. <laughs> if I can still connect with people, even if my videos only get like three to five views and I only have 200 to 300 subscribers, then that's fine. Granted, I would like to get more than that, <laughs> you know, maybe 301 subscribers. You know, that's, that's not too much to ask, right? In any event, you know, I've wrestled with the whole idea of just trying to, you know, get with the times and do what all the cool kids are doing and all that kind of stuff. And it's just, I don't know, like some things I've incorporated, but there's a lot of things that I haven't. And the main reason is, again, connection, feeling connected with somebody, being real with somebody. And that's the reason why I do the things I do on YouTube. And, why I don't incorporate certain things, you know, like B-roll and all other stuff. And I realize that, that it makes the video easier to watch. I realize that. But it just kind of, to me, it kind of takes away from that intimate atmosphere that is one of the uh, charms of vlogging. You know, where it's, it's not fancy, it's not pretty, it's not all dolled up, it's not in a recording studio or in a recording booth with the lights and stuff all on you. Like, I mean, <laughs> throughout this whole video, I mean, you know, I'm going in and out of focus because 
of the way the lights are arranged. So like sometimes I look really good, like <laughs> like uh, here. Then other times I turn and it's like, oh, you can't see my face. <laughs> so that's part of the charm of vlogging, at least from my perspective. I know, like I said, it's not everybody's cup of tea. I realize that some people are, you know, really into the Casey Neistat style of vlogging where it's like drone shots, B-roll, a lot of really good high quality stuff. And that's fine. I mean, I love Casey Neistat vlogs, but I'm not Casey Neistat. So, um, and I know a lot of other people are trying to copy him. So let's just, you know, let Casey be Casey and let Andy be Andy. Okay. <laughs> just put it that way. So yeah, you know, in a, weird roundabout way um, the reason that I still do YouTube even after all these years and with very very low quote-unquote success you know subwise view wise the reason I do it is because I love it and I love connecting with people I'll close out this video by asking you guys why why do you like YouTube if you're a youtuber why do you do YouTube is it for fame for fortune is it to connect with people like me? Maybe not necessarily like me, but uh, you know what I mean. So yeah, just uh, put your answer down below in the comments, in the boobity boops, and I'll be sure to uh, respond in kind. So anyway, probably gonna go take an Advil or something and lie down because I am not feeling that good today. So with that said, this is the Andy San signing off for now. Thanking you guys, Pook, for tuning into this rambly late night lack of energy vlog and for watching my other stuff and again apologies like i said for the lack of energy in this vlog I'm trying to put as much chutzpah into it as i can but i'm very limited on energy and uh, i also want to thank you guys for being so patient with uh, the lack of new videos due to various personal circumstances life time energy name any of those <laughs> anyway i just want to thank you guys and you know i want to thank you guys for sticking with me through all this all 285 of you at the time of this recording hopefully we can get a couple more maybe 286 or something <laughs> but regardless i want to thank you guys for uh watching my stuff and i also want to thank you guys for liking the thumbs or the stars for you old school YouTubers. Comment, subscribing, sending a few friends to the party. And hey, as always, we'll see you next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye.